customer survey or customer satisfaction survey many agile teams conduct customer satisfaction survey to get the product feedback or whatever product they are launching in the market they do the customer uh, survey and get the feedback from the customers to see whether that particular product meets the customers expectations and if it is easy to use for the customer or customer finds it very helpful to use or there are some um, flaws or some uh, more enhancement that needs to be made or customer feels that um, there needs to be more refinement or more features to be added to make it more presentable and more easy to use for the customer and that's the key reason many agile teams perform customer satisfaction service to get the feedback you would have noticed many uh, products uh, are launched in the beta phase um, for example even when gmail came through it it uh, initially launched as a beta product and it was invitation through only so that these are these uh, sort of beta releases are the key um, reasons to get the overall feedback from the customer through the customer satisfaction survey or customer feedback now customer feedback whatever is feedback provided by the customer is used to improve the product the key reason for the customer satisfaction survey is to get the feedback and to improve the product whatever customer has requested or whatever is feasible to be implemented in the product and that feedback also aids in key decision making so for example you have launched a beta product and uh, the feedback that you are receiving is not um, good at all or it it is basically it has a lot of uh, concerns that customers are, are raising so that gives you an idea that the product is not going to succeed in the wider market if you if you release it so it it also gives you feedback whether you should you know like release it to the wider audience or fix all those issues that are being raised by the customer before you uh, release it to the wider audience in the market and that helps in the key decision making of the product release as well now metrics and feedback um, that are received from the customer feedback should not be used to reward or punish any team in agile it's the um, collaborative responsibility of the whole team to for the quality and for uh, the product release so any metrics or any feedback that is received by the, uh, whether it is from the customer survey or from the internal metrics uh, which is the defect density rate or any of the existing testing um, uh, feedback or uh, testing uh, metrics that is existing in the product um, all those metrics should be only utilized to improve the product and not to reward or punish anyone in the team so these are some of the key benefits of having a customer satisfaction survey or customer survey um, before you launch the product to the wider audience in, uh, in agile development approach. Thank you.